This is a demonstration of a library written in Python that allows the Onion to talk to an Arduino using I2C and uh, exposes most Arduino functions through that uh, Python library. The Onion here is in the breakout uh, dock primarily because the Arduino dock that I have is not accepting flashes anymore, so I am, for the purposes of finishing this demo, using the Onion integrated to an Arduino Nano instead of the Uno functional that, equivalent that is in the, uh, the, the Onion dock. So the demo is going to use a rangefinder with a buzzer to indicate proximity to the rangefinder, a variable resistor as part of a voltage divider to adjust sensitivity for the rangefinder, and a servo which demonstrates the position that the sensitivity uh, knob is in by rotating you know, from, uh, you know, from right to left. And then finally, a push button which uh, ends the script running on the onion. So with no further ado, okay then, here's our demo. On this screen, this is a session running on the onion. We're gonna run the demo application that controls all this. And it, not the fastest computer in the world, but it's small. Once it fires up, there you can see the range threshold is zero and the distance between the range finder and the phone is coming up as 14.5. The servo that indicates the position of the sensitivity adjustment is all the way to the right as this adjustment is all the way to the right. If we start turning this to the left, we'll see the sensitivity, the threshold is going up and the servo is reflecting the position of the knob. The phone is currently 14 centimeters away and the threshold is now greater than the distance of the phone. If we move the phone, the distance to the back wall is now greater than the threshold. If we put the phone back but further away, no buzzer. And if we move the phone closer, buzzer. And then if we desensitize, now we've got the sensitivity so that it's uh, back to zero. So let's just get it a little bit above zero. Now it's at 5.3, the phone is eight away. And we have to get the phone quite a bit closer, and out of the way, everything shuts off. And the last thing we do is press this little button, and it's detected, and the script ends. And that's basically all she wrote.